Hi, I'm Tom Chick, and you don't need me to tell you that because you're one of my Patreon supporters. And what this is, is a monthly drawing of what I'll be reviewing that has been requested by a Patreon supporter, namely one of you. The way this works is once a month, if you're a supporter for $10 or more, in which case, seriously, thank you. That's, that's incredible that you would do that. Uh, but if you're at that level, I'm going to send you a message and say, hey, is there something that you would be interested in reading a review that I've written about? Man, that's terrible grammar. Uh, is there something that you would like me to review? That's way better. Uh, a video game, board game, a movie, a book, anything. If so, e message me back and it's going to go into a hopper and in a few days I'm going to do a drawing to determine what I'll be reviewing. And that's what this video is, is the drawing. Uh, the idea is once I draw one of these things, I've got a cheat sheet here with everything that was submitted. Once I draw one of them, my deadline will be two weeks from today and that's when before then, uh, I will be posting, then or before then, I'll be posting a review of whatever that was. We had 10 submissions this month. Uh, I hope it doesn't violate anyone's privacy if I do, if I say your first name and your initial. That's cool, right? Uh, uh, at any rate, that is cool, right? Nobody minds if I say their name. I shouldn't be agonizing about this. This is cool, right? If you don't want me to use your name, please let me know. Uh, David D. requested Barry Lyndon. It's a Stanley Kubrick movie from way back when. I haven't seen it since probably high school. All I know, Ryan O'Neill is in it. It's a period piece, so they have like frilly sleeve things. And Kubrick shot some of the scenes by candlelight. It's famous for that, right? Uh, that's David D's request. Intriguing. Matthew C. requested a Trevor Chan real-time strategy game called Seven Kingdoms. There's actually two of these. There's Seven Kingdoms 1 and Seven Kingdoms 2. Matthew C. said I could choose either one. These being video games, where sequels are always better, I think I would go for Seven Kingdoms too. It's the opposite in movies, by the way. In movies, sequels are always worse. Sandu N chose Scythe, uh, a gorgeous board game that has been recently released from a company called Stonemaier Games. They made a board game I really like, also gorgeous, called Euphoria. Uh, <laughs> Leroy V, I, I love this pick. I Kind of hope he wins. Uh, I don't know if he picked this because he knows my opinion on it. Uh, Leroy B. requested Mage Knight. Now, I, I'm not given to hyperbole or exaggeration. I, I mean this in all sincerity when I say, I think Mage Knight is one of the worst board game designs I have ever encountered. I think it's terrible. Now, that doesn't stop me from trying it. Uh, in fact, if you were to turn this camera around and look at that table right over there, I have set up a game called Star Trek Frontiers, which is a, a, a Star Trek reskinning of Mage Knight. I, I, I don't know why. At any rate, Leroy B. wants me to review Mage Knight. I would love to do that. Uh, Chris M. requests the first season of The Wire. I've never seen The Wire. I know, I know. Craig requests something I've never heard of, a two-player deck builder card battling game called Epic PvP. Man, there's a generic name. Uh, and, okay, this is it. Andrew S. requested something that's out of print. So, Andrew S., if this wins, I might be contacting you for a runner-up. Uh, he wanted me to review a card game called Space Hulk Death Angel. And everywhere I checked, it's out of stock. So, uh... Oddly enough, I have had that recommended to me before. It's something I'm interested in trying. Uh, but when things are out of stock, I, I don't really know how to proceed. So we'll see if that wins. We'll burn that bridge when we get to it. Uh, Jarmo P requested a game called Card Hunter. It's a video game. It's also a little deck builder. Uh, it's got a just tactile RPG made by some very feisty Australians who call themselves Blue Manchu. Uh, okay, Clay H., a few of you sent in a, a list of things, and you're like, hey, any one of these is great. No, 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 you have to pick. Uh, Clay H. did something similar, but it, it's a bit of a larger project than I think I'm willing to get into at this point. What he said was, read Roadside Picnic, watch Tarkovsky's movie Stalker, and then play the game Stalker. All three of those are Russian. Uh, presumably they're all based on Roadside Picnic, this Russian novel. Uh, he said, do those three things and, and then write about the, the commonality amongst the different media. 
uh, I love the idea of Clay H. It was a bit too much, so I asked him to narrow it down to one of those things. So he said, okay, read Roadside Picnic. By the way, I've seen Tarkovsky. I haven't seen Tarkovsky's Stalker. I have seen his other video game movie, Sacrifice. Not really a video game movie. Uh, and then finally, uh, we have another Andrew S. I think it's really cool that I have two Andrew S's as Patreon supporters. Andrew S requested, I've never heard of this. He says it's a JRPG on the Vita that he's playing that he really enjoys. The Legend of Heroes Trial... Tri I wrote Trials of Cold Steel, but it's got to be Trails of Cold Steel, right? No, trail Trials? Trails. No, I wrote Trail... I at any rate, I'm very confused about what it's called. I don't, that's just word soup to me. At any rate, that is Andrew S.'s request. Uh, these are the 10 requests. We're now going to do a drawing on the internet and see which one wins. So I have here on my iPad, the internet. I open the internet up and we go to this, right. We go to this thing right here, which is random number generator. Well, it's, what is it? randomresult.com and this is going to choose a random number between check out that spelling I love that 1 and 10 uh, the default setting by the way for this is 10 and we have 10 choices 10 submissions so let me then press this and we will at the same time find out what I'm reviewing ah, this is hard to do backwards go engage the winner no I have, I have selected the word distinct here we go Draw now, go. The winner is, what is that? I can't see that. One. All right, which would have been, uh, oh, Barry Lyndon. Now, all right, here's the deal. Uh, this is like my, all right, I'm gonna come clean with you guys. In the interest of full transparency, uh, this is like my fifth time recording this video because here's what happened. See, I've been trying to... St okay, here's the deal. I recorded this video. I did everything like you just saw. Did the 10 things. Uh, and then I did the drawing. And then a 6 came up, which is the game Epic PvP, which is what won. I don't know what it is. I So it won. I went in, uh, to make sure I could get it, and I ordered it. Because Amazon, <laughs> Amazon.com was like, if you order this in the next one hour and eight minutes, we'll get it to you by Tuesday. So I was like, yeah, I'll order it. I ordered the two expansions. Then I copied the video over to edit it, this video. Let me make sure, yeah. Uh, and, and I'd forgotten to, uh, to turn on the mic. So here's what, here's what it sounded like. So that's, there was a whole video of that. So I thought, well, uh, I could just redo it and uh, show them that I got a six and hope that they believe me or, but that kind of ruins the immediacy of the moment. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna keep recording it until a six comes up. <laughs> all right, it's been five, I don't know how many I've recorded these, but here's the deal. I, all right, David D, I'm gonna, re I'll, I'll review Barry Lyndon. You win, and uh, Craig, you win. So there were two winners. It was my own fault, uh, and actually I'm happy to do this. To, uh, truth be told, yeah, I would, I would be, I would ha be happily, I would happily do all ten of these. They're all great, uh, but because I screwed up, six won before. I promise, I promise a six won. Uh, and it's the, that's the actually the only one. Yeah, that's the one that I have the least frame of reference for that I know the least about. Oh no, that Legend of Heroes: Trials of Cold Steel. Don't know anything about that. But at any rate, so here's the deal. I have a deadline of two weeks from now to post reviews of Epic PvP, which is the original winner, and I've got the game on the way from Amazon.com to show for it, and the drawing you guys just saw happen with your own eyes, this couldn't be faked, uh, for Barry Lyndon. So there you go. That is the beginning of the Patreon campaign, it's a patron request monthly drawing. Uh, if you'd like to participate uh, next month, all you have to do is make sure that you support me for $10 or more uh, when the end of the month rolls around. Uh, so you have to be like billed at least once and then I'll send you a message. You can pick whatever you like and then we'll do another one of these videos next month and hopefully I'll remember to turn on the mic.